get some hot pads. Okay, so actually, so I, I pressure cooked these these chickpeas, right? The best way to do chickpeas, they came, like I said, they came out of a bag like this, soak them overnight, cook them either on the stovetop, it takes a lot longer on the stovetop if you have a pressure cooker. Use the pressure cooker, it takes like 20, 40 minutes. It's not bad at all. So we did that, and then, uh, dripping a lot. Strain these and then actually the same thing with the chickpeas you guys I'm gonna put out another towel on my table and you want to just you really it's not really about drying these out but just cooling them down before you store them they're soft you get so many so many out of this like this bag turned into all of this after soaking and cooking them Sorry, then a third camera. Yeah, I did a third and a fourth camera. I want to get one, I think an overhead one, so you guys can see me when I'm like cutting stuff up, and then one for my stove, like dirty ass stove. I probably need to clean more often. And slurp, slurp on down this fa. Sahtan, Abby. Buen provecho, chico. I hope it's good. Not gonna lie, you love your pressure cooker. It's so useful, Maddie. It's so useful. I mostly use it for cooking beans, but. And, oh, uh, I make really good bone broth from my pressure cooker, like cooking whole chickens. I do that all the time. Um, I like getting the broth because there's this one Lebanese dish or Arabic dish called menuchia. Hard to say, it's hard to pronounce. Menuchia is uh, really good and you need chicken stock for that. I love using my pressure cooker to make chicken stock as well. You need one for your kitchen set up and need one for art streams, you want to paint again. That would be really lovely, Abby. Definitely should do those. Um, okay, so, actually I ran out of, do I have one more towel? I do, I have one more towel left. So let me go spread these out and then we'll uh, figure out what else we're gonna do. So again, the reason I spread these out on a towel, more surface area, is just to get them to cool down really good. Oh my god, these are so hot. doing a roast chicken in your pressure cooker slides right up the bone not the main thing so um yeah usually i'll put a whole chicken in um carrot celery garlic 